like that intro man a lot is in the news you know what i'm saying it'll in the news man man so much this is get with the meat potatoes because i know you guys don't you guys got short attention spans y'all like don't even like videos unless they have all these colorful flashes and uh lighting and uh transitions and i, j I just don't have none of that right now so <laughs> but the intro i made how about that anyways check this out so activision had like a little meeting i don't know what the meeting was to you uh, yeah well it was some sort of meeting and uh, they told the uh, couple of youtubers because or what what's the, what's the polite word i like to say uh, uh i want to use the name trails but uh you know people that advocate for activision's little uh, compromises that they do uh, in other words skill-based matchmaking stuff that uh you know yeah the things that like to rile people up you know whatever but they distinctly told this guy who's uh he's pretty this pretty well on his youtube channel i don't know i would think that he's um i would honestly in my personal opinion think that that guy's a little uh on the opposite side of the team when it comes to the females you know what i mean and that's not because i just think it it's because of things that he got going on and he does some sketchy things as you you know sketchy but you know uh whatever that may be if you uh, just teach their own use your use your imagination well anyways this guy reports don't got no problem with them but yeah he likes to advocate for uh, call of duty and uh, he said a couple things but the thing you know who cares what he said it was what activision said it's what they it's what they said he couldn't say and uh they told him right out check this out check this out yeah you know uh Rapal says activision told him can't ask cod devs he, oh excuse me he can't ask the cod devs about skill-based matchmaking one of the biggest issues in the community has and they still won't talk about it for four years later yeah you know i mean uh, the, you know that the, i mean for call of duty the meat and potatoes is one thing right money for two uh it's the engagement of the people there's little things why they do why you can't exit the lobby right before the match like you ever notice that you can't exit the lobby right when the lobby's done right when it shows the timer of whatever it shows on the screen like a 100 to 99 and you try to exit the game they're like nah nah bro nah you can't you can't do that it's got to be something fishy about it right so they get all this data and then they give to the investors and sit there and say oh yeah look at this this is the this is the 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 the, the numbers for people that are engaged in the game and then they got this man i don't even want to talk about the system right now but i just you know yeah you can't ask nothing about skill-based matchmaking bro bro why no because you already know that dude that dude if you ever watch any of his little podcast he he likes to bring up controversial stuff from time to time you know he dibbles and dabbles not how i would do it but more i would ball sprawl I'll, I'll, I'll dive right in bro dive right in dive right in but he likes to keep it a little more you know subtle but he still asked the questions and they blatantly told him Anyway, then anyways, on to some other news. On to some other news. Check this out. Just check it out. So yeah, I know you see me uh talking through here. Guy got some good gameplay. Don't get me wrong. He calls it a knife, but technically what he's using is a Chinese star or you know, whatever they classify those as, but I guarantee it's not a knife. It does pretty well. But do you notice anything? Some good gameplay, uh. What the heck? That guy's just what that guy's just shooting at the sky. This, this guy's no nothing to worry about. That guy's just standing around. This guy's just running around. That guy's like, yeah, whatever. I mean, uh, something ain't right here. Hey, we would all like juicy lobbies like these. 
Not to say that he's not doing good. Again, it takes a little skill to throw this star sometimes. Somewhat. I like using my knives. But, uh, something. Something looks, looks great. Looks like a skill-based matchmaking lobby made. He gave him a, a great lobby. Oh, and he got that MB MGD. MGB, excuse me. He got that nuke. Oh, yeah, nice, bro. You did so nice. But check this out. Check this out. So it seems that this guy is, uh, well, he's claiming through the text there. Somebody asked him, how do I get in these lobbies, man? How do you get these lobbies? These lobbies look juicy. These lobbies look awesome. And he's like, yo, I just uh, pushed start on the game. You know, I just pushed the button. I was ready to go. Hmm. Right. So let me tell you something before I let you guys go. Two things. One. See if you're gonna reverse boost, at least admit to the people that you're doing so. Don't make it so obvious with your bot lobbies like this guy that you see in the background right here, over on the ground. Yeah, look at this guy. I'm over here messing around. Yeah, don't make it seem like you're uh, you're this cod god, cause you're not. Just admit to your people that what you're doing, and it helps. Number two is if you see up in the corner, in the right upper corner, I got a giveaway that I'm gonna give away a PlayStation or an Xbox or you know whatever you want at 25,000 subs so when you subscribe and you hit that like button it helps me get to that point and I get it I get it. I really don't make videos very much but I've been starting to try to you know dibble dabble I used to make them all the time but now yo it's up to you to think that this video is great or maybe it just sucks and if it does suck let me know say this video sucks I made it this far you suck bro and I'll be like okay <laughs> Whatever. Tweet your own. Have a great night. Thanks for watching, and uh, we'll see you next time.